Okay. We have reporter Adriana de Alba joining us live from Hampton with the latest where a memorial wrapped up earlier tonight. Adriana. That's right, Jacqueline, and that memorial was very emotional. As you can imagine, more than 100 people came out tonight in support of little Noah and their hope to find strength and comfort in each other. And for the first time, we heard from a woman who was Noah's foster mom at one point. Thank you guys. Everybody is here for coming out. As the sun began to set over Hampton, the candlelights flickered below. People in the community came together for two-year-old Noah Tomlin. Very emotional. A little boy is lost. We don't know where he is. Noah has been missing since Monday. Police are still searching for him and said he's believed to be dead. For the first time, the woman who was Noah's foster mom at one point spoke out, emotional and sharing what Noah meant to her. Bless his little heart and blue eyes. You couldn't tell him no. <laughs> Although I call him no no. Because that's all he said was no no. <laughs> but he sat on the couch with me and held my hand. <coughs> and he just grabbed my hand. Like as if to say, I know I'm safe. Little Noah brought more than 100 people together. His disappearance is difficult for the community to grapple with. It's been awful, y'all. Yeah. I just now came out of the house yesterday. Wow. Because I missed that baby. Remember that Noah means comfort. That's what those who came out hope to find comfort in each other and hope for little Noah Tomlin. The woman who organized tonight's vigil doesn't know Noah personally, but she told us that she has felt the pain ever since that little boy went missing. And she wanted tonight's vigil to be about positivity and Noah, nothing else. Those were her words. We're live in Hampton. Adriana de Alba, 13 News Now.